welcome back to my channel this is going to be like a cheat chat get ready with me and guys i did my nails like a week ago and i don't know how you guys do this but this is so <laughs> it's so not me because it's so stressful but i did get like a pr package from revolutions um makeup i want to be i'm going to be unboxing as well as like playing around with the new product as well and then just talking about life in here they sent me three new palettes this is the bronze glow palette the nude on nude palette and the 24k palette we have the 24k gold primer right here we have setting spray and last but not least we have finishing powder so this is what we have in here okay so i literally just washed my face i literally just had my bath actually so i'm just going to go ahead to just moisturize my face i'm going to use this moisture potion from mismetics it's a nigerian brand you can use whatever moisturizer you love and works for you and your skin type i'm just going to literally massage this into my skin i really do love it when my face is really really moisturized because i do have a dry skin i keep on saying that all the time so really what is up with you guys it's been a while since i did makeup on here just so you guys don't get confused this channel was initially a beauty channel and now we have kind of transitioned into like beauty and business related content but we still love the glam so we're going to be kicking this off with the 24k gold primer right here So now that we have this, this is so gorgeous. This is so beautiful. It comes in a bottle. This is what it looks like. It looks so beautiful. So I'm just going, oh, this smells nice. This smells very clean. Okay, so I think I can see the gold reflects. What's going on? I feel like it's been a while since I last filmed. I haven't filmed like in like two weeks. I know I've been posting content, but I actually haven't filmed in like two weeks because um, I don't know, life just happened. But I like I batch create a lot, which is something I really talk about in my you know YouTube business related content. I talk a lot about batch creating just for days or weeks like this where I'm not in the mood to you know film so i have content that i can always post when i'm not at work basically so i'm going to be using the nuban beauty in my skin foundation in the shade seven so we are almost at 100k guys and i'm super excited um i feel like this is this has been like one of my biggest goals for like youtube 2020 my youtube related goals for 2020 and the year isn't over yet and we're like like almost like 20 days away from hitting it and i'm super excited and i'm also grateful for like just the support and your time as well i don't take that for granted so i'm just going to apply this this is looking weird if it's not me I feel like it's looking weird. So what I like to do is I like to um, apply my foundation in areas where I have more pigmentation, more discoloration. And that is usually like around this area and this area, right? So when I do that, I focus less on applying a lot of product on the center of my face because I'm still going to go in with like highlighter and powder and all of that. So I don't want it to be too heavy or too cakey. So I'm definitely noticing something different about my foundation application. I feel like the primer is kind of gripping on to this foundation. So I'm definitely be planning a giveaway for the 100K. I've literally been planning this for like um, a couple of months. Like I've been looking for inspirations and like ideas for the giveaway. But I want it to be something filming related or like you guys know what i like i like like equipment and stuff so i do want it to be like equipment related because i feel like most people that are following me now are like beginner youtubers 
and all that so i do want to give something that would be beneficial if that makes sense but still very true to my brand if that makes sense i'm using a darker foundation just to add um a dimension to my face and a little bit of coverage as well so um i'm still thinking of what to include in my giveaway so in case you guys have any suggestions um recommendations ideas feel free to let me know down your ideas are so um what's what i want to use i i, I need them <laughs> they are so welcome and that's going to be so appreciated so i'm going to be using a concealer this is the early girl concealer in the shade warm honey and i'm using the same foundation brush to just place this product the exact places that i want it to be before i go in to blend it out i feel like the last time i filmed a video was when i tried following harushi's um tutorial i'll leave the link up here so you guys can check it out well i totally enjoy watching um other makeup artists do their thing and learning from them as well i'm not a makeup artist i'm just literally a girl who just does makeup to be honest with you so most times i like to learn from people who are experts are doing it right so that way i don't waste my time trying to figure out figure it out myself you know and i think that's what i want to be doing in terms of like makeup tutorials I think I want a full coverage beat look. I want a full coverage beat look. I want to look like I'm going out and about. So there is no doubt about this. Guys, let me know down in the comment section if you fix your nails and how you deal with it because this is such a struggle. I can't even type properly. I can't edit videos fast. It seems like it's, I'm just, I'm like this close to getting a pair of scissors and like chopping it off to like my normal nail length. But I think what I'm going to do next time is that because I do a lot of, I don't want to say manual labor, I do a lot of like, um, I use my hands a lot, makeup, hair, typing, editing, filming, like it's so hard. I'm going to try and be making sure that my nails are work friendly, if that makes sense. So yeah, I'm just going to blend this out. So again, like I said, please let me know down in the comment section what ideas you guys would have for a giveaway I'm so excited okay let me just blend this out right now all right so this is what my face is looking like right now I blended everything out and in I'm gonna be using my Juvia's Blaze um, loose setting powder in the shade Sahara I'm gonna use this to just set down my under eyes I still haven't found a foundation that is my perfect match I'm gonna be using the revolutions um, banana powder just to snatch my face even more I'm gonna bake so I'm gonna have to do my brows off camera and I use my concealer on my lids just to kind of create a base. So I'm going to be using the 24K Gold Palette by Revolution Pro. Let me just open this up so we can see. This is like a first impression, try on, chit chat, review sort of thing. This is, ooh, this is quite heavy though. This has weight to it. Let me just open this up. Yeah, so this is what this palette looks like. Let me just take this protector out of it these are what the colors look like hey there are a couple of like brown shades that we can definitely work with but let me go in with coin this is it right here i'm going to use coin as my first transition shade wow that is pigmented that is so 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 pigmented so that's definitely a good thing. I hope it doesn't have a lot of fallouts 
So I'm going to go into mine. It's like a shade darker. I'm going to use that to just intensify that brown. Oh, wow. This palette really is pigmented. Just look at that. Okay, so we're going to add more depth to it because I'm loving how it's looking so far. I'm going to use plate, this shade right here. Also on the outer corner. Look at that. Let me just put that here. You know what? I feel like I'm too far away from you guys. Let me change my lens. So we're just going to blend. I think I should have used this lens all along. I'm just going to blend this properly. Okay, so this is what we're looking like so far. We've smoked out the eyes. Get deep into that and use this to act as my base. Okay, that like I kind of like this addition. <laughs> Let me just pat that on to my lids and blend that as well. Uh, so this is going to be good if you maybe want to cut your crease, you just want to use this as your, what's it called, base, definitely, definitely works. And I do love that it's not creamy. I do love that it's not like runny. Like it's, when you apply it, it dries almost matte immediately. If that makes sense. It dries down almost immediately. So I know that it's going to be a good base. Okay, so I'm kind of tempted to go nude like this because I do love like a neutral eyes, but I'm going to just play around with the shade. I think I want to play around with let me just use this shade this is gilded let me use this so this is it definitely pigmented i did not wet my brush but you guys are already seeing that the shade is showing off i'm gonna go in with that initial brush that i used in applying the dark browns and just blend that shade in right so like there's like a smooth transition this doesn't look bad at all i kind of like it i really do so let's just let's just take this up a notch let's just take this up a little bit so i'm thinking i'm going to use this um how kion how how kion how how kion how kion i'm going to use this shade right here and just this is like a glitter shade oh my god i think i'm gonna regret this mix it in with the gold leaf i feel like i'm gonna regret this but hey 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 we're in it to win it okay okay that wasn't bad i actually like the glitter to be honest with you it wasn't bad so I think I'm done with this palette. Let me just go ahead to tidy up this entire space because it's so rough. I want to maybe wing my eyes a little bit, line my eyes with a brown um, liner and then apply my lashes and then come back and complete the entire look. Hey guys, so I went ahead to do my eyes and also to do my lips. But now I want to play around with the last products that we have. This is the goddess glow finishing powder i'm i'm kind of intrigued and i'm i'm curious to know what this is about i don't know if this is a setting powder because if it is then <laughs> it might not work for me because <laughs> of the shape look at how i'm literally struggling like i just want you to come out okay I definitely love their packaging. There's always something so lush about it. They always stick to like the gold or rose gold tones. So let me see what this is. This is the darker shade. This is in the shade Splendor. Let me just open this up. Okay, I think this is definitely a highlighter. Okay, so this is what the finishing powder looks like. This is in the shade Radiant and this is in the shade Splendor door right there let me just swatch them both on the back of my 
my hand so that you guys can see them these are what these two shades look like um they're definitely like a powder finish but then it has like hints of shimmer to it i think it is going to be like probably my favorite um what's it called highlighter just because of how smooth it looks like let me just blend these two in together so you guys can see like it looks so smooth and radiant i don't know if you guys can really see this i hope my lighting isn't oh yeah that is it can you see that not even like it's like a sheen it's a glow exactly that's why it's called the glow powder it's like a glow and not like a highlighter it's just like a really soft subtle glow i'm definitely all about that so i'm going to be using this to just glow up my face a little bit let me just get my fan brush and do this and i love this because it's not even looking it's not looking like too overpowering it just looks very soft you get me dust off the powder on my face and then sets my face as well okay so this is what my face is looking like i'm gonna use the 24k gold oh my god it does have like gold reflex in it i'm quite scared just because i wouldn't i don't think i might want my face to look too shimmery but this would be perfect for like pictures and like summertime hey guys so because this 24k gold fixing spray has a lot of like shimmer in it i'm kind of scared to use it so i'm gonna go in with the glow fixing spray first and then just use a little bit of this to add glow and shimmer to my entire body so let me just do this right now so i'm gonna take the 24k fixing spray and just spray the sides of my face as well okay so this is a finished look this is a look that we just created right now trying out new products from revolutions pros collection this is a complete look let me know what you guys think down in the comment section with the entire look but also on how these products performed um i wanted this to be like a very chatty video but i think i'll make another video a very chatty video because this one was more focused on the product's performance as opposed to my talk i guess so so if, in case you guys enjoyed this video let me know down in the comment section in case you guys want more tutorials like makeup beauty hair tutorials let me know down in the comment section and that is going to be really fun because i do have a lot of like hair you know videos that i actually want to film and I'm so excited for also beauty and makeup as well. But still, you know, business, YouTube growth and all of that. So let me know down in the comment section as well. I enjoyed this video. I think I'm satisfied with this look. I think I can take a picture and feel bum. <laughs> so yeah, let me know what your thoughts are down in the comment section. I'll see you guys down there. Till then, stay fabulous and stay blessed. Bye, guys.